All right. Shalom Rastafari. Some wish of time. Um, so called good news on Huff Post right here. All right, but this is the follow up on this particular thing, you know, with the the marathon, what's called the marathon attack, the two bombs that exploded in Boston on Monday, right? What I thought was really interesting about this whole story right here, they're, now they're talking about in New York, um, Bloomberg and everybody is, you know, in Gotham City seeking to take advantage of it. You've probably seen the graphic uh, photos, the graphic pictures, and, you know, um, just our prayers be with the innocent. Look, JFK explosion investigated. What? There was a JFK library explosion? I didn't hear about that on the news. Well, thank Huff Post right here for pointing that out. But it's just very interesting, the whole marathon thing and the fact that um, the Ethiopian shall be at his steps, right? That's what it said, that the Ethiopian shall be at his steps. So let's click on this one right here. So this link from um, Ross Johannes from Lidge, I think, Yifti, or Ross Johannes right here. Um, that actually was looking at, are you a Hasid or Orthodox Jew? So let's bring up this page. Well, let's bring up this page right here. And here's the page on Sodere. Okay, let me turn that off in the background. Heckle and Jekyll are speaking on the news, right? This is Ethiopian social media network videos, right? So let's see if we can re re um okay here now the page really is coming up more properly right so daddy right so daddy and it was this particular article that we had caught in our teferi rastafari blog right um right here are you uh rastafari are you a hasid or orthodox jew and if you click on the article right down here, you can read more. But then there was the news story over here that caught my attention. Let's see if we can bring this up. This is the news story right here that caught my attention, right? Bombs explode at Boston Marathon, raw video, Ethiopian uh, Lelisa... The CISA wins Boston Marathon. Well, I guess we're not going to really probably hear about that, are we? Well, here on Sodere, thanks to Sodere, right, we can hear a little bit more about it. So the bombs explode at Boston Marathon, raw video, right? The Ethiopian, Lelisa, the Caesar, and that's the Caesar right there. He wins, right? He wins the marathon. But then, boom, boom! Boston Marathon explosions. Police confirm explosion near finish line. And then there's a raw video. You know, everybody likes it raw nowadays. But here's here's a little hidden detail in the matter. And the Ethiopian shall be at his footsteps, right? Ethiopian Lelisa de Sisa wins Boston Marathon. So we want to speak about the Ethiopian who, win, who won the Boston Marathon, but what immediately took the attention away from the winner of the Boston Marathon on, ironically, Patriots Day, right? How coincidental or pre-planned was that? Right, two explosions struck the Boston Marathon as runners crossed the finish line on Monday, witnesses said, injuring an unknown number of people on what is ordinarily a festive day in the city. Police reported at least one explosion, and witnesses said there were two which hit as spectators were cheering on runners finishing the race. Now, 
we don't even hear about the winner of the race, right, or who crossed the finish line first, but it was the Ethiopian Lelisa de Sisa pictured right here, right, crossing the finish line. I think it was right over, right over here somewhere, right off of outside the camera shot where the explosion would happen minutes um later so they have this article right here um and they have a little bit of a write-up right here lisa de sisa of ethiopia has won the 117th get that right there boston marathon men's title in a time of two hours 10 minutes and 22 seconds the CISA finished five seconds ahead of Kenya's um, Micah Kogo, right, earning $150,000 and the traditional olive wreath. Now, Gebra Xavier, Gebra Mariam of Ethiopia was third. So we have one Ethiopian. Well, actually, two Ethiopians. One Ethiopian wins, a uh, Kenyan second, three Africans, right? Two Ethiopians and, and one Kenyan, right? Now, the CISA ended a three-year run of Kenyan men's champions in the event, right? And then, but Kenyan Rita Jeptu, she won the women's race in two hours, 25 minutes, 25 seconds, for her second, her second Boston Marathon victory, all right? Then they tell you about how many other people were there, but let's keep some of these um, tags right here for our vid. I don't think anybody has really commented on it, but I thought that was interesting, this particular story right here, which um, you're probably not going to see on mainstream uh, media. Does it have anything to do with it? Well, I think so. I think so. I know that Ethiopia is written in the scriptures. So there's prophecy concerning Ethiopia. And like the Matrix movie said, right, the prophecy, at least the way the prophecy has been interpreted by most um, nominal Christians, is false. It's the other half of the story that hasn't been told. Anyway, brothers and sisters, Bombs explode at Boston Marathon. You've seen the raw video, but do you know who the winner or the winners of that were? I mean, so sorry for the innocent, right? But then that should not take away from those who are innocent, like the CISA and the others who won. Now, this is going to be used just to take away more of people's rights and to keep them in a, in a fear you know, in a fear matrix. Come out of Babylon before it's too late. Shalom Rastafari Salamta Eina Yist Erling. This is Wendem Yadin. This is Brother Ras Iodonis Tafari reporting for the LOJ Society of His Imperial Majesty. Check this article out on Soldare. Shalom. <laughs>